That is so grim. This is something you won't see every day. Oh my god. They're just quick. That's now, the issue. You won't, you won't. Now, I'm just going to put this in and just stretch it a little. Feel funny. Just let me know if it hurts. It shouldn't hurt. It's just like a maggot anyway, isn't it? Mm-hmm. You are. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, How big do they feel under the skin? Quite a cavity, isn't mm. it? Yeah. Is that sore when I do that? Not particularly. It's a bigger hole than I was expecting it from. Yeah. yeah. The, those two are the biggest holes, I think. In my mind. No, I'm okay thanks. I just want to I don't want it to slip. I don't know how good these vortex are. It's a big one. Okay. Can I say? Oh, oh my God! God. Like that big. Yeah. Oh, that like that. Yeah. Quite a bit. Yeah. A little bit. It did hurt a bit. Yeah. That's fine. It doesn't hurt. Oh, you bugger. <laughs> yeah, they're quick. That's the issue I had when I was trying to do it on my own. I couldn't squeeze, pull. What did you get one out at all? Quite no. Small. The ones no. I got out by myself were out more than this. They were literally halfway out, it was easy. Yeah, they got you. Relaxing Sunday morning. There we go. Is that one passing over That was annoyingly so. Here we go. Yeah. Keep watching. And they're real punched out holes, aren't they? They're immaculate holes. Like a pinhole. Like a bullet hole in a pinhole. There's a game, because I'm in the grill. There's quite a big hole in there, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to get them out yourself. No. No, these. I'll use eyebrow trees, tweezers. These aren't out as much as the ones were at the airport. These tweezers, the airport might have teeth on them at the end. Yeah, Dad, you don't want to pull too much in case it ruptures.
could actually do a good girl, well done, Anna. Very well. You are a star. You are the bear grillis of the female world. <laughs> <laughs> you really are. <laughs> Oh, uh, weird. <laughs> That's the third one. Is there a way to tell if there's more than one in a hole? Only if it's, it's it, yeah. Just have to wait and see, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dear me. It's going to do with the room. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't, it's a real mess. Oh my god, there's doors hanging off and all sorts. Oh, and yeah, he's gone. I think you could add this to your CV, mate. Yeah. Definitely. Tropical disease. This is definitely experience in tropical disease. I'll take these fishing with you down. No, it's not, it's not his head yet. Those little black bits are like spines. I'm going to have nightmares about this tonight. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good Lord. Should only be one left. He's probably been having those antibiotics, I think, isn't it? Well, they released their own antibiotics. Yeah. So the antibiotic for themselves probably haven't done any no, You don't get complicated, well, you don't really get infections from it. Yeah, you don't get infections. It's just scars when, when yeah. they come out. Because there's quite a big hole underneath there, so that's going to be the only issue that it's probably not going to heal that great. Right? What we'll do right? is we'll flush the hole out. We'll get some saline. Have you got any yeah. saline around? We'll yeah, it could do with all getting cleaned up. I'll go and get. I'll go and have a look. Um, Otherwise, we're To be honest, you can probably get some from the chemist. Have we got some? Have we got some? Probably, yeah. I'll just make that stuff. Mm -hmm. There's a one in fourteen million chance. Tremelinos for you. Is that what I say? <laughs> yeah, one in fourteen million, and I got seven. It's probably slightly more dangerous tremelinos. <laughs> well, yeah, different type of bites though. Yes. Mm. And do you think you've got all of the holes at the same time? Do you think yes. No, they definitely all appeared on the same day. Were they that large? The ones you pulled out? The yeah, slightly smaller. Wiggling. Wiggling. Still doing. Mm -hmm. There's a new one. That one's crawled right across there. Well, I don't want one. massive. And this one in the middle. I don't know, is... I'd say, I wonder if you could um, Preserve uh, them. keep them. Kill them, dry them. You can keep them then. I'm sure to you, of course. Because what if they can dehydrate or rehydrate and come alive again? <laughs> They're not going to take any risks. I was considering contacting like someone and seeing if they wanted to do. I read an article about a guy who had them, and he contacted like a uni or something mm. and said, "I'm willing to keep them on my arm if you want to do research." Obviously, I wouldn't say that, but yeah. if someone wanted to practice or do research in them or something. Oh, oh, blimey, I just thought your arm was really sore. Yeah. It, it was really sore, sore at times. It the was sore at times. Horrifically sore. Fully alive still. I mean, grotesque yes. things, aren't they? Well done, guy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> 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 See, but these are just.